so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Flippy! Hey! It's me, Flippy! And today, I'm here at the Postal Museum in London, England. <laughs> and I am so excited because they have play areas, postal games, and even a mail train! Woohoo! <laughs> Let's go see what it's like to be a postal worker. Come on! <laughs> Whoa! Check it out! We're here in the Postal Play Place. <laughs> Whoa, this looks so fun! <laughs> Come on! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Do you see what it is? The post office. Hmm, we should go inside and see if we can help send out some mail. <laughs> Ooh. Hello! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Looks like there's a lot of packages here and a lot of letters! Well, we want to make sure all the packages can be sent out, but we need to make sure they're weighed to see how heavy they are first. <laughs> Ooh! <laughs> this one looks good to me! <laughs> no way! Check it out! These packages are animals! Whoa! Look! This package is a giraffe! <laughs> and has a really long neck. <laughs> well, this is a fun package to send. <laughs> and <gasps> no way! Do you know what kind of package this is? It's an elephant! <laughs> <laughs> well, that's cool too. <laughs> a teacup? <laughs> well, that's pretty yummy. Hmm, would you like some tea too? <laughs> Blippi tea party! Woo! <laughs> just kidding. It's just a package shaped like a teacup. <laughs> well, I think we can find a place to deliver this letter. Yeah, keep your eyes open. <laughs> it looks like we're here in London. Well, little London. <laughs> yeah, there's all kinds of things in the city, like a house plant. <laughs> Whoa, and a comfy couch. Ooh, <laughs> look. <gasps> It's a red and yellow delivery truck. <laughs> Looks like the car wants to go to sleep. <laughs> it's so sleepy. <laughs> Whoa, and check it out. A horse-drawn carriage. Yeah, it has one, two little horses. <laughs> Traffic jam! <laughs> well, let's keep looking for a place to put the letter. <laughs> Whoa! Look at this! There are all kinds of blocks! Hmm. Maybe we can build a giant British castle! <laughs> okay, let's see. <laughs> Whoa! We did it! Yeah, you see it? so big! <laughs> yeah, what happens if I accidentally <laughs> knocked it down? Uh oh! <laughs> and since we're here in London, can't forget the red phone booth. Ooh. Let's see how many we can find. One, two, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, We found 12. That is way too many phone booths. <laughs> but good thing we still have our letter. Hmm. Hello, kitty cat. Hello. Meow, meow. <laughs> you see? It's a kitty cat. <laughs> That's so cute. <laughs> Wonder where we'll go next. <laughs> Hello, double decker bus. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> oh, no way. I think I see where we can send our letter out. <gasps> it's a post box! <laughs> yeah! Okay, here we go! Letter away! <laughs> oh yeah! <laughs> Whoa! Oh look! A red hat and hmm, a red post office vest! One arm and two arms. Woo! Ready for work. <laughs> Whoa, that 
is a lot of mail to send. <laughs> well, good thing we're really good at delivering mail, so this will be easy peasy lemon squeezy. <laughs> okay, let's get all the mail. Here we go. Okay, I got all the mail, but we need to pay for it, so I'll see you on the other side of the counter. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> that is a lot of mail! <laughs> yeah, and we can ring it up right here at the register. <laughs> oh, that's a lot. <laughs> okay, well, we paid for the mail to get delivered so that the post office workers and the delivery men can get paid too. <laughs> Well, now we got to deliver all of this. Here we go. Whoa, yeah, we did it. Now we just need to deliver all these letters. <laughs> okay, here we go. This is a lot of work working at the post office, <laughs> but it sure is fun because I'm with you. <laughs> Wait a minute, I almost forgot. We have all the packages, letters, envelopes, but they need to be sorted before we can mail them out. <laughs> oh, well, good thing the sorting office is right over there. Oh, yeah, when we go in the sorting office, we can sort the mail. <laughs> Come on. Now, let's deliver the letters. Ooh, see some houses. Wait a minute, this house is really tiny. <laughs> That's because, look, it's a mouse house. <laughs> Hello. Oh, look, there's a yellow house, a red house, and an orange house. <laughs> yeah, they have some pretty colorful roots. <laughs> okay, here's your mail. One, two, three letters delivered. <laughs> Whoa, but look at this. Hmm, this is a pretty interesting looking jacket. And, <gasps> whoa, it's a giant sack of letters. Huh, big bag of letters and interesting jacket. <laughs> we'll have to try it on. <laughs> whoa, <laughs> this is cool. <laughs> But I wonder what this is all for. Hmm. Hi, Blippi. Oh, hi. What's your name? My name's Andy. Oh, it's nice to meet you, Andy. <laughs> well, we've been having a lot of fun today, but I've never seen a jacket like this before. So that's the sort of jacket a letter carrier would wear a long time ago. Whoa, that's so cool. <laughs> well, I love delivering letters. <laughs> and maybe we can pretend to be a letter carrier from a really long time ago with our bag of letters <laughs> and our cool jacket. <laughs> well, do you think we could deliver some more letters? We have a challenge for you. A challenge? A postal challenge. Whoa, that sounds like fun. <laughs> We'd like you to deliver these three letters into three different post boxes around the museum. Oh, that sounds really fun. Well, we found some post boxes. I bet we can find some more. <laughs> Here you go. Okay. Oh, a real challenge. Postal challenge. <laughs> well, thanks, Andy. No problem. Okay. Good luck. <laughs> See you soon. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Whoa! I just can't wait to deliver these letters. <laughs> and I love the mail. But do you see where we are? <laughs> yeah, we're in a tunnel. Whoa. <laughs> this tunnel, there used to be trains. <laughs> I love trains. <laughs> yeah, all kinds. Diesel trains, electric trains, and steam trains. Choo choo! <laughs> yeah, and this is the train depot. Yeah, that's where trains would come to get fixed up. <laughs> yeah, if they were broken or just needed a tune up, they could come here to get all fixed. <laughs> Whoa, and I think I see a train over here. <laughs> Let's go! Whoa, check it out! <laughs> it's a train! It's a red train, but it looks kind of small. Hmm. <laughs> That's right. 
That's because this train track used to have mail trains. Whoa, yeah. Mail trains were trains that helped deliver the mail, letters, and packages too. <laughs> yeah, and this track used to go from Paddington all the way to Whitechapel in London. Woo! <laughs> and it would help the letters and whatever mail needed to get delivered, get delivered more easily. <laughs> Choo -choo! <laughs> hmm, but wait a minute, mail trains didn't have any seats for people. Yeah, that's because the mail trains were filled with mail. <laughs> but it looks like this train has chairs and seats. Whoa, well, we need to deliver some letters. Maybe this train can help us deliver them. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and do you see this right here? <laughs> it's a really big battery. So I bet this train goes really fast. <laughs> yeah, they used to be electric, but now battery power. <laughs> okay, let's get in the train. Can't wait to deliver these letters. We're in the train. Well, uh, it's so small in here. Uh, I can put my letters there and uh, squeeze in right here. Uh, whoa, this is so fun. Yeah, traveling in a train underground. Woo. Uh, oh, look at it. It's so old here. <laughs> I can't wait to deliver the letter. Uh, whoa, it's getting really dark. Yeah. The ceiling is so low because we're in a really tiny train. <laughs> yeah, we can imagine that we are a package or maybe a letter from a really long time ago. <laughs> this is fun being male. Ooh, I think I see something up ahead. <laughs> We made it to a platform. <laughs> Let's get out and deliver the letter. <laughs> Whoa, that was so much fun riding on the train. <laughs> and look at where we are. We're here at the mail station. This is where the mail trains get all their packages and mail. <laughs> Woo this place is awesome. Check it out. <laughs> These are the mail train tracks. Yeah, this is the tracks that the mail trains would deliver the mail on. <laughs> They're so small. Well, that's because the mail train is really small too. <laughs> Do you see this part? Yeah, the tracks cross. Yeah, they make little X shapes. <laughs> that's because the mail trains sometimes need to change directions. So it's easy for the operator to move the trains around. <laughs> no way! An actual 1920s mail conveyor belt! <laughs> oh, that reminds me. Yeah, the mail station is underneath the mail sorting area. Yeah, it's kind of where they would sort all the mail and letters and things so that people would get the right letters. <laughs> yeah, it would go on this conveyor belt right here. Oh, check it out. <laughs> this is where the mail chute is. The letters would go down the chute, over the conveyor belt, onto the trolley, <laughs> and then onto the mail train. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. <laughs> We've been trying to deliver a letter and look at what it is. It's a post box. <laughs> yeah, now we can deliver the first letter. <laughs> first letter, it says, hello from London. <laughs> okay, here we go. <laughs> yeah, we did it. Whoa, oh, hi Andy. Hi Blippi. <laughs> Whoa, check it out, a red and green car. Well, Andy, what's this? This is our pneumatic train game. What you do is you turn the handle, that powers the fan, and then the air pushes the car up the tube. Oh, that's amazing. So these are air powered? Yeah, these are powered by air. Whoa. Pneumatic is the word for that. Pneumatic? Whoa, that's a pretty funny looking word. <laughs> 
Well, wait a minute, Andy, there's a red car right here and a green car right here. One for you and one for me. Do you think we can race? We can have a competition. Okay, <laughs> shall we start? Are you ready? One, two, three, race! You won! Yeah. <laughs> oh, you're really good at this. <laughs> well, it's really fun to play with some toy cars in a pneumatic tube, but I see this big picture here. It has a really big pneumatic tube. What's this? So this is a small version of a real life version they built on the banks of the River Thames in London a long time ago. Whoa. And it was designed to carry mail before the mail rail. No way. So these little cars, they weren't for people, they were just for mail? just for mail, but this version could uh, uh, occasionally carry people. Whoa, that's pretty amazing. Yeah, we just rode the mail train. <laughs> but I guess before there was a train, they used these tubes, right? Yeah, that's correct. <laughs> Whoa, that's pretty amazing. Well, Andy, it was so fun racing you with our pneumatic tube cars. <laughs> but I have some more letters to deliver. Well, thanks again so much. I'll see you soon. <laughs> Woo, let's go deliver some mail. Bye. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. We're here in a traveling post office. Yeah, this was a train car on a big train. It's kind of like the mail rail, but it's not as small. <laughs> yeah, and you see right here, this is where a post office worker might sort all the different mail. <laughs> and look, there are letters right here. Woo, this one has an airplane on it. <laughs> Whoa, and check it out. This one has a car. Honk, honk. <laughs> hmm. And this one has a little puppy dog. <laughs> oh, hey, I think it's a game. I think we need to sort all these letters into the right spots. <laughs> okay, let's do it. Puppy dog and puppy dog. <laughs> car and car, and airplane, and airplane, <laughs> yeah! Whoa, whoa, look, do you see it? The floor is moving. <laughs> I bet it was really tricky being a traveling post office worker. Yeah, because the floor would move so fast and the train would go so fast and it would also be kind of noisy too. <laughs> well, that reminds me, we have another letter to deliver. Hmm. Well, maybe we can put it in a post box. Ooh, I see one over here. <laughs> okay, here we go. Whoa! <laughs> we did it! <laughs> I think we need to get off this train. It's so bumpy. <laughs> Whoa! I'm having so much fun delivering all these letters. <laughs> Whoa, and check it out. Tubes! <laughs> hmm, but these aren't just any tubes. These are pneumatic tubes. Whoa! <laughs> yeah, pneumatic means anything that uses air. Yeah, and a pneumatic tube used to help deliver the mail. <laughs> yeah, it used air kind of like a vacuum. At the end of the tube, a motor sucked out all the air and then the mail would shoot through the tube. <laughs> yeah, it would travel in one of these canisters. Ooh, and it looks like someone wrote a letter already. <laughs> it says, hi. Ooh, I bet Andy wrote this letter. <laughs> hey, maybe we can send it back to Andy and say, hello. <laughs> okay, let's try. Yeah, you open up the tube here, put in the canister and Did you see that? <laughs> Whoa, that's pretty cool. <laughs> and look, Whoa, it's gone. <laughs> hmm, that's pretty fun. It's a pretty amazing way for mail to travel. Ooh, but wait a minute, I have an idea. What if we wrote a letter to Mika and sent it through the pneumatic tube? <laughs> okay, let's try it. First, we just need a piece of paper and an envelope, a pen, Ooh, and a tube. Oh, a canister for the tube. <laughs> okay, hmm. What should we write? Dear Mika, Ooh, I hope 
You are having a great day. <laughs> I am having so much fun in London at the Postal Museum. <laughs> hmm. I hope to see you soon. <laughs> Your best friend, <laughs> Bolippy. <laughs> okay, then we just need to fold this up <laughs> and we'll put it in this envelope. <laughs> then we can put the envelope in the canister. Just open it up, put it in there. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> now we can send it to Mika. Hello, Mika, here you go. <laughs> Whoa, it worked. <laughs> That's gonna be a really long trip to Mika. <laughs> well, anyway, we have some more letters to deliver. <laughs> okay, <laughs> let's go see if we can find another post box. Hmm. Oh, hey, there's one right here. And good thing we have oh, our last letter. Yeah, letter number three. <laughs> okay, here we go. <laughs> yeah, we did it! Whoa, that was awesome. I had so much fun delivering letters, playing games, and learning what it's like to be a postal worker here at the Postal Museum. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. <laughs> hey, can you spell my name with me? Okay, <laughs> ready? B-L-I. P-P-I! -I. Blippi! Good job! <laughs> well, I'll see you soon! Bye-bye! <laughs>
Whoa, yeah, look. If you see it from this angle, it looks like a diamond. But I bet. Now, it kind of looks like a square. Woo. Yeah, a square. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> I should probably get down from here. Okay, here we go. Woo! <laughs> well, that was pretty fun, but I think I need a teacher to help me out a little bit. <laughs> it would probably make it a lot more fun and I could probably do some cool new things. <laughs> hmm, let's go find someone to give us some tips. an aerial instructor. <laughs> Whoa, she's really good at this. <laughs> oh, maybe she can teach us. <laughs> Let's go ask. <laughs> Hi, I'm Blippi. What's your name? Whoa. Hi, Blippi. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Kimberly. Oh, it's nice to meet you, nice Kimberly. To meet you. <laughs> Whoa, you're really good at aerials. Thank you. Whoa. Ooh, well, we were doing some climbing and some spinning <laughs> and some swinging, but do you think you could help us? Uh, can you dance? Oh, I love to dance. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I love to dance. Perfect. Let's do some aerial dance then. Aerial dance? Oh, you mean we can dance, but in the air? That's exactly it. <laughs> yeah, I would love to. All okay. right, grab for your hammock. Okay, here we go. Whoa, <laughs> look at this hammock. So big and purple. <laughs> it's like a sail. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Woo. <laughs> okay. I have the hammock. Grab for one edge. Bring your thumbs inside. Okay. Fingers, all four of them, on each hand. On the outside, slide your hands outside of your hips. Okay. Reach for six handfuls. One, two, three, four, five, six. Perfect. Bring those elbows in, shoulders in. Ooh, okay. Press your fingertips towards the ground. Jump up inside. Whoa, <laughs> check it out. Ooh, we made it in the hammock. Hands up high towards the sky, all the way around the outside of the back. Grab it like a rope on each side. You can walk your legs forward so you're sitting on the very edge of this little ledge. Ooh, nice. And then slide your hands down so you've got it on both sides, just like you'd wear a belt. Ooh, here we go. <laughs> Good job. Yeah. All right, we're gonna go upside down. Are you ready? We get to go upside down? <laughs> yeah, I'm ready. You're gonna take your legs wide, keep your hands still, and then bring your feet together all the way around the front. Okay, here we go. Upside down, blippy, woohoo! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa. And then take your right foot and your left foot all the way around the outside of the purple fabric Ooh. to the front. Okay. Good job. Whoa. You look awesome. good. Yeah. <laughs> thumbs up. Thumbs up. Wait, thumbs down. <laughs> so silly. <laughs> okay. You want to go for a spin? Yeah. Let's do it. Time to spin. <laughs> Don't want to get too dizzy. <laughs> oh, so what should we do next? You want to do a handstand? Yeah. All right. Your fingers come on the floor directly under your shoulders. Tuck your chin to your chest. Look at those toes. Flex your feet. Straighten out your legs. Now straighten out your hands. Whoa. Feet towards the sky even more. Handstand. Yeah. Check it out. Whoa, that was fun. You want to do a no hand handstand? A no hand handstand? Sure. All right. Straighten out the legs. Straighten out the arms. Okay. Hands off. Whoa. Check it out. No hands. How stretchy are you? Can you reach to your toes? Reach for those toes. Yeah. Bend your knees. Whew. And lift up. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa, we're up so high! But I do have one question. Kimberly, how do we get down? Oh, well that's even more fun. You're gonna reach for both hands on one fabric. Okay. All right, keep that left knee bent. Reach the right toes towards the floor. Come forward. Yes. And slide those hands down. Bend your right knee. Grab a hold of your right hand with the right foot. Ta-da! Ta-da! Pigeon drop. Whoa, this is awesome! <laughs> Whoa, check it out! Look at these! <laughs> Whoa, they kind of look like a hammock, but there's not a place to sit. What are these called? This is called an aerial silk. It's like a hammock upside down. Whoa, an upside down hammock? <laughs> That's fun. Well, how do we play with these? You want to try to climb it? Yeah, that would be great. Okay. You're going to grab a hold of it. Okay. Yep. <laughs> and I want you to kind of hug the fabric with your legs so your right leg comes up. Okay. Turn around, give it a giant hug, and flex the foot. Okay. You're going to slide the fabric underneath the toes. Oh, okay. 
And then you're gonna reach your other foot onto the fabric and kind of hook it like you're crisscrossing. Great. So I pull cool on the fabric. One toe to the other. Yep. Like that. Awesome. It gets easier if you use both hammocks or uh, both silks. Do you want to try it together? Yeah. Okay. We'll try both silks. See if I can climb to the top. Okay. Okay. So bring them together. Give it like a giant little bear hug. Your uh, leg. <laughs> okay. Now we take our leg around. That's right. Like this. Yep. Flex our foot. Bring it as high as you can. Even higher, Woo. even higher. Woo. Good job. And then up we go. <laughs> Woo! You can go higher. Okay. Whoa! Look how high I am! All the way to the top, Lippy. Good job. Whoa! I made it to the top. Whoa! Look at how high we are. Everything looks amazing from up here. Okay, I think it's time to come down. Nice and slowly, you're gonna squeeze your legs together and walk your hands down. Work with your legs, not with your hands. Whoa, here I go! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> we made it! Good job! Yeah. Nice landing. Whoa, that was amazing! Whoa, you've taught us so many amazing dance moves and how to climb a silk. <laughs> Thank you so much for teaching us today, Kimberly. You're welcome. Uh, well, I'll see you soon, I think. I have all these tools. Now I can do my very own aerial blippy dance. Bye-bye. Bye. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> it's time for some blippy dancing. <laughs> yeah. Kimberly was so helpful and taught us all kinds of dance moves. And now we can take those dance moves and make blippy choreography. Oh, that's kind of a big word. Choreography. <laughs> have you heard that word before? Well. It's just a big fancy word for lots of dance moves put together. <laughs> we can do that. Time to dance. a great day with you today, learning all about aerial arts. <laughs> and we even got to dance to our very own aerial blippy dance. Woohoo! <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, can you spell my name with me? <laughs> great. Okay, here we go. B-L-I P-P-I, Blippi. Good job. <laughs> well, I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Woo! <laughs> Whoa! It's me, Blippi. Whoa, and look at where we're at. Whoa, what a cool store. Hey, wait a second. We're at Allegro Performing Arts Academy in Kent, Washington. Yeah. Do you know how I like to dance? Whoa, yeah. Wow! This place is where you can come and dance in one of their studios, and you can even maybe take a dance lesson. Woohoo! <laughs> this is gonna be so much fun. Let's go! Oh, hey! Hello! Who are you? My name is Emily. Who Ooh. are you? I'm Blippi. I'm here for the class. Awesome! Sounds like so much fun. Yeah, what should I do? So, you can go ahead and go back into the studio and I'm going to be able to teach you a dance class today. Okay. So okay. go ahead and start stretching. Okay, let's go stretch and get warmed up. Let's go. Whoa! Check it out! This is a dance studio. This is where you and I are gonna learn our dance from Emily. Whoa, check it out. There's some nice smooth floor. Yeah, it's really shiny. <laughs> Whoa, 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 look at this. This, yeah, this looks like a mirror. Whoa, hello, hey. <laughs> yeah, dance studios have mirrors right in front of you, so then you can practice your dance moves. Whoa. Yeah! Wow! <laughs> and see how you did. 
I definitely nailed that one. <laughs> okay, remember what Emily said? Yeah, we need to stretch and we need to warm up before she comes in to teach us our dance lesson. Okay, first things first, I need to take off my shoes. Oh, oh, so stinky. <laughs> okay, let's put them right over here. Now we need to stretch. Yeah, we need to stretch our muscles really far and wide so we do not injure ourselves. So first, let's stretch down. See how I'm stretching? Oh, I can almost touch my toes. <laughs> now we need to warm up, she said. Yeah, that means we need to get our body moving in some way or another. I mean, you could jog if you want. Yeah, you could jog. You can do some squats. <laughs> wow. Or you can just do some sweet dance moves to warm up. Yeah, that's what I like to do. Hey, Blippi, do you want to learn a dance today? Oh, hey, Emily. Yeah, I love learning and I love dancing. <laughs> Sure. Awesome. Would you like to see it first? Yeah. Okay. She'll show me the dance first, and then I'll learn it. Whoa, that looks really hard, but I think I'm up for it. Will you teach me? Absolutely. Okay. <laughs> All right, so how we're gonna start is we're gonna start really close to the floor. So you wanna make a ball pose. You wanna get really close into your knees, right? Okay. Yes, from here, you're gonna hold four counts. So you're gonna count in your head. One, two, three, four. Then you're gonna make a big star pose, jump your legs out, reach your arms way up to the sky. And you hold this for four counts, and we're going to count it five, six, seven, eight. Then from here, you're going to shake your hips side to side with big arms, starting to the right side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yes, now we're going to learn what's called a grapevine. Yes? Ooh, okay, yeah. I don't see any grapes, though. <laughs> Silly goose, it's a dance move. So oh, you're gonna okay. start with your hands on your hips. You're gonna step out with the right foot. You step out to the side. You cross this next foot behind, your left foot behind. Then you step out again. Then you're gonna jump together and clap on count four. <laughs> and then you're gonna step out to the side on the left. Step out to the side. Cross that right leg behind. Step the left foot out, out. Jump, clap together. Good. Okay. Then from here, we're gonna make strong arms down at our sides. You're gonna step, touch side to side. So you step out with the right foot, out, then step together with that left foot, together. Step with the left foot out, right foot together. Step right foot out, left foot together. Good. Step left foot out, right foot together. <laughs> now, last thing we need to learn. You're gonna step out with your feet, hands are gonna go into your knees. You're gonna bounce two times. Ready, you bounce. One, two, then you do two claps. Clap, clap. But it has to stay at the same tempo as the music. Okay. <laughs> yes. So you bounce. One, two, clap. Now make sure your feet are nice and wide apart oh. because we want to be confident when we dance, right? Oh, okay, yeah, confidence. Absolutely. So we always want to make sure we have nice wide feet. Close feet, not so much. You want nice wide feet. So you do okay. want to try every single move nice and slow all together. Okay. All right. Now remember, we have to count in our head to eight. Okay. Was that it? That was it. Wow. That was it. I just learned that full dance and I think I'm ready. Am I ready? I think we're ready. Okay, awesome. let's hit that music. One, two, three, four, six. Shake your hips. Great, fine. Step touch. Bounce it. Good.
good job and good job to you. Thank you so much, Flippy. Yeah, well, thank you for teaching me and them how to dance. Absolutely. <laughs> hey, check this out. Emily's doing another dance. Come on. Whoa, this style of dancing is called jazz. It looks like so much fun. <laughs> you know jazz? Yeah, it's a type of music. <laughs> Check it out. Do you see what Emily's doing now? Yeah, she's doing ballet. <laughs> and she's actually using the ballet bar. Check it out. That is so cool, and this type of dancing is so elegant. Wow. Whoa! I have been having so much fun dancing today. Woo! <laughs> what? 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 Ah! <laughs> Do you like dancing? Yeah, I like dancing because it's a great way to Get out your energy and exercise. Yeah, I love being healthy. Hey, I have an idea. Why don't I teach you a dance so then you and I can dance together? Would that be fun? Yeah. Okay, the first thing about dancing is what's called rhythm. Yeah, every song has rhythm. It's basically the beat. Okay, so what we're gonna do is I'm gonna clap my hands and then you clap your hands with me at the same time, okay? Ready? Good job! Yeah! You feel this? Yeah! This is rhythm! <laughs> yeah! We did it! Good job! Okay, so now I'm gonna do that again, but now we're gonna want to move our legs to the rhythm, okay? Ready? Here we go. Here we go. We got it. Double time. Good job. Okay, now that we understand rhythm and beats, now we can learn the parts of the dance, okay? First thing, yeah, you see this up there? Yeah, what machine is that? Yeah, that is a bulldozer. So we're gonna dance as if we're bulldozers. First, you need to put your hands up like it's the blade of the bulldozer. Yeah. <laughs> okay, then you need to move your legs and dance like a bulldozer. Yeah, there we go. We're totally like bulldozers. <laughs> I love bulldozers. Whoa. <laughs> okay, all right, so that's gonna be the first dance move. And then the second dance move, yeah, we're gonna act like kangaroos. Yeah, do you know what a kangaroo is? Yeah, whoa, <laughs> such cool animals. <laughs> okay, the cool thing about kangaroos is how high they can jump. All right, put your hands like this, 
and then jump really high. Whoa! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> okay, I bet you can do that one really good at home. <laughs> okay, now the third dance move we're gonna do is, yeah, that's a dinosaur, isn't it? What kind of dinosaur is that? Yeah, a T-Rex, good job. Okay, so the funny thing about T-Rexes are they have short little hands, yeah, like that. <laughs> but they're actually really fierce, so you have to act fierce. <laughs> okay, but now we need to put that all into rhythm and a beat, yeah. And then you act like a T-Rex. <laughs> okay, those are the three dance moves. But now, remember, we need a rhythm and a beat. So, hit it, DJ. Remember the first one? Yep, bulldozer dance. Good job. <laughs> Plow the dirt. Wow, that was really good. I'm really proud of you. That was such a good bulldozer dance. <laughs> okay. So, now we're gonna go into the second dance move. Remember it? It was an animal. And it jumps really high. Yeah, a kangaroo. Ready? <laughs> wow, wow, kangaroos are so cool. Jump so high! Woo! All right, shake it off. Okay, now for the third dance move, the T-Rex. Ready? Ra! 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 Ah. Oh, oh, I am so tired. Did you see that? Yeah, that was so much fun doing all those sweet dances today at Allegro Performing Arts Academy in Kent, Washington. Wow. <laughs> I sure do love the dance. Hey, if you're around this area, you can come and do the very same creative movement class that I did today. Wow, that was so much fun. Or, yeah, I'm sure you have a local performing art studio where you can learn to dance. Yeah, there's a lot of cool dances you can do, like jazz and tap and ballet. Whoa, even acro. <laughs> that sounds like so much fun. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B-L-I-P-P-I. -I. Flippy, good job. All right, I'm gonna go and take a nap now at home. I am so tired. <sighs> Hello, hey, it's me, Flippy, and look at where we're at. Yeah, we're at Sanka, which is in Seattle, Washington. And Sanka stands for School of Acrobatics and New Circus Arts. Yeah! Have you ever been to a circus before? I love circuses! They are awesome! And today, you and I are going to learn about some circus art! <laughs> wow! Look at this place! It is so cool! And the floor that we're on is pretty bouncy! Whoa! Okay, the first thing I need to do is take off my shoes. Alright, there we go. Let me put them right over here. And now, before we do anything with circus, we need to stretch. All right. Ugh. 
Whoa. Yeah, it's really important to stretch so then our muscles are nice and loose. So then we don't injure ourselves. Oh yeah, there we go. All right, woo. Oh, I stretched out my back, my legs, my arms. Oh. Now that I'm all stretched, I think we should learn the rules of the circus. Whoa, check them out. The rules of circus. Yeah, number one, have fun. <laughs> That's pretty easy, we love to have fun. Number two, be safe. Yeah, safety is really important. We definitely don't wanna get hurt, do we? No. Number three, Work hard, yeah, I love working hard because it's so fun to start at one point and get to another. And the only way you can improve is working hard. <laughs> and number four, be kind to each other. I love being kind. It's so cool that you are kind to your friends and family. Good job. All right, now it's time for some circus stuff. Woohoo! Hey, check out what I'm on. Woohoo! Yeah! Do you know what this is? Whoa! Yeah, this is a trampoline. Check it out. The bouncy part. Yeah, what color is this? Yeah, this is the color black. Oh, and look at this. A safety pad. Just in case if you go off the center and then you don't get hurt. What color is the safety pad? Yeah, it's the color Red! <laughs> All right, let me jump. Woohoo! Can you think of an animal that can jump real high? Whoa! Yeah, how about one that carries its babies in a pouch? Yeah! Yeah, a kangaroo! Boing, boing, boing! Woohoo! What about one that loves to be in the swampy areas and it makes it sound like ribbit? Ribbit. Woohoo! Yeah, frog! Yeah! Woohoo! <laughs> yeah! Jumping is so much fun! Whoa! Did you see that? That was awesome! <laughs> hey, Bleepy! Hey! How are you doing? Yeah, good! That was awesome! Thank you so much! What's your name? My name is Max. Oh, nice to meet you, Max. Do you know how to jump on the trampoline? I sure do. Will you show us? Yeah. Stay right here. Kneel right here and wait for me. Okay. Ready? are called aerial silks. Whoa, they're so cool. Yeah, and I am in a green silk and Max is on a purple silk. Whoa, check it out. It's like I'm in a cocoon. Whoa, yeah. <laughs> Can you think of an insect that hangs out in a cocoon? Whoa, yeah. They start as a normal insect, then they go in a cocoon, they go through metamorphosis, and then they turn into a butterfly. Yeah, I'm a caterpillar. Whoa, look at Max, he's the butterfly. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa, check it out! This is a tight wire. Yeah, this is where you can practice your balance. Yeah! And balance is really important because 
Yeah, you might need it for things. If you don't have any balance, you'll just fall over. Whoa! You see what I'm using on my hands? Yeah, these are sticks. Just in case, if I need a little help. Whoa, whoa! <laughs> that was silly. I just fell. Let me try it again. Whoa! That's tricky! Wow, look at how good she is! Wow, she is so good! Hey, maybe now we can keep balancing on the balls! Wow, look at all these balls! Yeah, this is another great way to learn how to balance! Whoa, check it out. Look at this ball. <laughs> Whoa, whee. <laughs> yeah, I'm balancing on my stomach. Whoa, <laughs> that's hard. But hey, let's count all these balls. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Do you see how this ball's in a circle? Yeah! This actually will stabilize the ball. So then when I try and stand on it, then it won't move around so much. All right. Okay. Let's try this. Whoa. I am so excited. Whoa. 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 It's harder than it looks. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! If this stabilizer ring wasn't here, I probably wouldn't be able to do it. Whoa! <laughs> okay, let's see someone good do it. been so much fun learning about all these things circus related. Whoa, check it out. Wow, looks like we have some really cool things like rings. Whoa, yeah, they're so colorful. Hello, hey. <laughs> Ooh, looks like we have some really light scarves. Wow, <laughs> and looks like we have this wood stick. Whoa, what is that for? And a plate? Yeah, a green plate. I know what to do with this. <laughs> wow. Maybe, maybe I could juggle. Wait, he's not juggling. He's balancing. Let's try it out. Whoa, do you see how he just spun it really fast? Yeah. All right. I'm gonna put it on my fingertip. Whoa! Check it out! Whoa! 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 That's awesome! <laughs> All right, get ready for this. I'm gonna put it on my forehead and see if I can balance it. Ready? Whoa! 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 <laughs> So silly. Okay, let's see what else we have over here. Yeah. Remember the scarves? What color are these scarves? Yeah. This one is the color pink. This one is the color orange. And this one is the color yellow. And you know what I like to do when I have three items? Yeah! Juggle! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Whee! This is so cool! <laughs> yeah! I love juggling. Hey, speaking of juggling, maybe I could take these rings and juggle the rings. <laughs> First, what color are these rings? Yeah! 
a green circle, an orange circle, a red circle, a yellow circle, and a blue circle. All right. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> That's awesome! All right, let's take three of them. This is gonna be a little bit trickier. Here we go! Woo! How'd I do? <laughs> Whoa! Hey! Yeah! A giant circle! Whoa! Do you know what this is? <laughs> yeah! This! is a hula hoop. Whoa! Whoa, check it out! Whoa! Yeah! Woo! Woo! <laughs> oh, and watch this trick. When you spin it backwards, then it'll come back to you. Ready? Whoa. Ready? Max is riding a unicycle. Whoa, that is so cool. Yeah, it kind of looks like a bicycle. Yeah, but bi means two. Yeah, two wheels and tires. But unicycle, una means one. Check it out. Whoa, all of these unicycles have one wheel and tire. Whoa! That one, this one, look at this! This frame is the color yellow! Whoa! Wow! Whoa! Look at how small this is! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> they are so hard to ride! Whoa! This one is so tall! Whoa! How do you even get up on this? <laughs> I don't even know! Whoa! <laughs> okay, maybe I should find one that fits me. How about this one? This one looks perfect. All right, let me try and ride this unicycle. Okay, do you see how I have these bars next to me? It's so then I can hold on. And when I'm learning, I can learn this way and it'll help me balance. Whoa, whoa. Yeah, I definitely couldn't do this without holding on to these bars. Yeah, unicycles are actually harder to ride than bicycles in my, my opinion. Whoa, whoa, <laughs> whoa. Yeah, it's probably because on a bicycle, you don't have to balance forward and backward. You just have to balance Side to side, but in unicycle, whoa, whoa, you have to balance forward and backward. Whoa, <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try it with no hands. Whoa, whoa, <laughs> whoa, I almost fell. Let me try it again. Here I go. Whoa. Whoa! 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 That was awesome! <laughs> hey, come on in here! Wow! Look at this place! This is the fly room! Whoa! And check it out! See all this? This is their trapeze setup! It is so cool! Trapeze is awesome. It's when people climb really high up in the air and then they swing while holding onto a bar. 
Sometimes they just fall down to the net, and sometimes they grab onto other people. Hey, speaking of the net, check it out. Whoa! That looks like a really soft landing. <laughs> hey, come on! Wow! Hey, who are you? Hi, I'm Caitlin. Oh, nice to meet you, Caitlin. Hey, Caitlin does the trapeze here, and she is really good. Will you show us some trapeze? Definitely. <laughs> yeah. about circus training with you. Did you have fun? Yeah, I did too. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B-L-I-P-P-I, Flippy. Good job. Uh, <laughs> wow, this has been so much fun. <laughs>